The European Space Agency is to give more details on Thursday morning as to what may have happened to the Schiaparelli probe, which was supposed to have landed on Mars. Contact was lost during its descent before it reached the surface. Scientists are working to confirm its status amid fears the probe may have crashed or been destroyed. But its mothership has entered into orbit as planned, and the overall Mars mission is being declared a success. Mars is the closest uh, planet to us uh, where we, we find some situations which are maybe very, very good for life. So there was an atmosphere, a better atmosphere than today, different temperatures, better temperatures and also liquid water. So if there is life in our solar system beyond the Earth, then Mars uh, is the most, uh, the most interesting planet. Controllers at the European Space Agency headquarters in Germany did have reason to celebrate. The spacecraft on which Schiaparelli travelled to Mars went into orbit around the red planet successfully. The orbiter carries an atmospheric probe to study gases around the planet, such as methane, a chemical that on Earth is strongly tied to life. It's thought its data could provide clues as to what's happened to the lander. There's certainly a sense of unfinished business here at ESA's operations centre in Germany. We have very good news. The TGO, the Trace Gas Orbiter, has entered into orbit around the Red Planet, and that's going to be a very useful spacecraft in terms of science for many years to come. Jeremy Wilkes in Darmstadt, Germany, for Euronews.